Disturbing new details tonight just in from a just released 911 call in the case of a Raleigh teen mom accused of breaking the legs of her one year old son. Steve Dorsey joins us live outside the Wake County Courthouse with more. Steve? Well, Tisha, according to these Wake County court documents obtained by ABC 11 Eyewitness News, 17 year old Princess Zamat is no stranger to police. Now she's charged with felony child abuse. 17-year-old Princess Zamad walked into court today. She's accused of intentionally breaking her one-year-old son's legs. Police say investigation to the alleged child abuse began when apparently Zamat's mother, Jacqueline Williams, who lives in the same North Raleigh apartment, called 911 on April 28th. I have a 17-year-old that has a one-year-old baby, and she is failing to take care of the baby. The baby has been on the floor. He is soaking wet. And she, she's asleep and won't take care of the baby. Police say the boy was taken to the hospital where doctors determined his tibia and fibula in both legs were fractured. Uh, hi, uh, this is Steve Dorsey from ABC 11 News. A woman inside the family's home wouldn't answer the door or identify herself when we knocked. She said she had no comment. Kenny Josephs lives near Zamat and says he's seen her son before. Yeah. I always expect good things from my neighbors, but that definitely was not a good thing. I feel bad about I feel bad about that. I hope I hope the kid's okay. You're also here for violating a court order. Earlier charges are also pending against Zamat, including misdemeanor assault with a deadly weapon and communicating threats. Zamat is currently being held on two hundred and ten thousand dollars secured bond. According to the latest update from Raleigh Police, Zamat's son is uh, recovering right now at Wake Med. He's awaiting his release to social services. Reporting live tonight in Raleigh, Steve Dorsey, ABC 11 Eyewitness News.